guys, it's time for another Supergirl reaction. We're up to episode 16 of season 2. And in front of me here, I've got a bottle of ginger beer and a jar of whiskey. Now, I feel like maybe I got the proportions wrong, maybe, but it's okay. Let's be honest, the main reason, the main reason I wanted to have a whiskey and ginger beer was so I could... Mix, 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 mix. And then grab this thing. And hopefully it fits. Oh, just perfect. Soon to be perfect. Oh, yep. I'm just gonna add the rest of that. We're ready. When I was a child, my planet crippled. Your Highness, we reached our coordinates, finally. We've arrived. Wait, are they? The parents? Are they his parents? Wow. Where? You mean a musical? <laughs> yes. Yes. Are you serious right now? Dead serious. You are opening the floodgates, my friend. <laughs> we have to watch Funny Face. It's Fred Astaire, Audrey Hepburn, Be Adorable. Is this a Glee? The most romantic movie ever. Reference? <laughs> because we all know that that <laughs> what? is Rachel <laughs> Berry's thing. That smile. Do we need to open the episode with this? We demand oh! oh, They fell asleep. We know. They Terry Hatch is his mom? Mother. Hmm. Father. My son. Finally found you. I mean no one was surprised though, were they? Everyone guessed that. She says, like she guessed that At three long minutes ago. Last. <laughs> Leave me. Leave her, come on. <laughs> oh my god, wow. Wow. I tried to tell you so many times, okay? Doesn't really matter! Am I supposed to make this better? No! Oh, look at that. Looks like McConnell forgot to sign the warrant. You got 24 hours, a minute longer, and I'm coming for it myself. I love she Maggie. What? Me. When did that happen? Type. Thank you. Oh. Sometimes the people closest to us are our biggest blind spots. Thanks for the input, Kara. Oh, she's. Oh, Morris, we're looking for a girl. I love that they get Alex to do it. Monel is young. He can be the face of that future. Okay, bye. Where's Alex? Not today. Yeah, took her time. They need you. They love you. I'll just throw that chance away because so many of us don't get one. He could right all the wrongs that he you're, you're a prince. thinks happens on Daxon by leading like the new world, right? He could make up for everything that he regrets. I mean, that would be the most heroic thing to do, I think. When the client will be that would certainly anyway. redeem him. I'm here, I... Makeup is so good on this show. Cue Alex and Guardian, right? Did you seriously not bring back up, which is Alex Danvers? Guys, come on. Rule number one. Always waiting for the opportune moment. Oh, thank God. Nice See? Okay. As soon as he sees Alex, he's like, oh! <laughs> Traffic is brutal. She just loves to make an entrance. I'm scared him. Almost as good as I do. <laughs> Take me home. Take me home, cute. He wouldn't. I don't know. At least he's honest. But... Cause I think... I think it's not enough that he loves her. Like that's not an answer. Whether we're together or not, being near her makes me a better person. It makes me the person that I want to be. I wish you no ill will. But you should leave this planet and never return. Like turning a blind eye to it doesn't make That's it any. Ha! <laughs> Darren oh, Chris. He looks Shit. Fun. Shit. Oh, there you are. I've been looking for you. Who is that? What the fuck? Oh, I am there. Oh, yes. 
Oh! I am so there tomorrow night. Oh my god. I love musicals. Shit. Okay. Yeah, so the only real thing I have to say about that episode, um, and the whole Monel thing in general, is that I do think he should have gone with them. Like, I, I don't know, in my head that's sort of the way I would like write it and love to see it go, is that he would actually do the more heroic thing and go to Daxon, which I know would take years and years and years to um, effect change, but like isn't that more heroic, right? To, to change the path of the Daxonites and to show them a better future and to just Oh, like that would be so brilliant. I would actually get behind that and I would like him for it. You know, that would be absolute redemption in my eyes for his character. Now it's going to be written that he just like hangs around and sulks with Kara there and eventually like proves his worth that way. But then like, like I said before, turning a blind eye to your past and the wrongs you've made instead of trying to correct them isn't really the right thing to do and I know that obviously me saying that is better, uh, easier said than done but this is a TV show and you can write these things in a way where he disappears for probably the rest of the season and then comes back next season and then like shows all the changes he has made and I think that's a really admirable thing that he would have done but they're not going that route it's okay <laughs> They're completely not going that route. Um, but it would have been so good! Oh! It's alright, it's fine, it's fine. Um, so I'm wondering, but his parents wouldn't just let him go like that, right? They want to just appear for one episode. That seems a little, because they spent the whole season looking for him, and then that's his whole story. I don't think it just ends there. Maybe it happens at the end of the season, we'll, we'll see. Um, and then they can do that in the hiatus and stuff. Anyway. Overall, no real major issues apart from the typical stuff that Supergirl's doing at the moment. Um, but definitely excited about the musical episode. I love musicals. I it's it's strange because Glee was my everything, but when they brought in the newbies in season four, I really didn't like Melissa slash Marley. I she was one of the reasons I stopped watching that show, so it's going to be really interesting to see what it's like to watch The Flash and to see the three of them, the three former Glee kids together and singing. I think obviously now I like love Melissa and everything that she does, so I think maybe it will be a healing process for me, um, but I'm super excited about that. I guess that comes out tomorrow, so I would definitely be doing a reaction to The Flash, even though I'm so far behind. But I think it'll be like a standalone episode, so it should be okay. So until next time, guys, bye.